Hey, good morning. Road trip off to Paso Robles. It is our team camp, the Sierra Nevada team camp. Uh, today, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Uh, yeah, gone, gone again. I uh, got back on Monday from Arizona for my uncle's funeral and then a couple days of work and then this was already planned, so off to team camp. Great ride today. Are you doing like the Blair, the Blair Witch project with that? Because I don't know. <laughs> you were kind of, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> it's like yeah, a cycle you know. cross race. Yeah. No, we're still going to dinner. <laughs> Haven't, didn't do any vlogging <laughs> very much on the, on the first day and didn't run a camera. I got here, I was just tired. I need to get in the mood to ride. Didn't film anything, but it was a great ride. Steve had an amazing route. It was climby and punchy and descendy. And was there any flat? I don't think. I don't know no, if there was any flat. Not really at all, huh? No, no it was no, good. Super beautiful route. Kind of wish I had taken the camera, but I, I did it. But now it's dinner time. I'm gonna go eat. I'm hungry. Dinner's done, we're gonna go get ice cream. Like a bunch of kids. I know, I'm already Bunch of cheering. There's always room for ice cream. Hey, can I say hi? Hey! <laughs> this downtown area in Paso Robles is like one of the, the movie downtown. <laughs> Or the, t the TV show downtown. The, they always use the um, the one from Back to the Future. Oh right. Yeah. At um, yeah. at Universal Studios, mm -hmm. and this is what this little downtown looks. On the Apple phone, it has, you know, you can set your alarms and then it has like a bedtime alarm. Well, the, the bedtime alarm was set to weekday and that weekend, so I set it for 8 o'clock. We had a later rollout. I heard John get up. I was like, oh, I'm going to sleep in a little bit. Next time I look at the clock, it's like 9.15. I have to rush and get ready. Run to Starbucks and get some coffee. I was tired. I think I fell asleep at like 10.30 last night. I was, I had a long, good rest. All right, so this is a real bummer. My TA2 battery is completely dead. I charged it before I came, like full charge, checked everything, I broke the bike down, cleaned it up. I have no idea. It was, I, did, I made sure not to lean it up against any of the shifters last night. So, I, I don't know. I'm not gonna go on the entire ride. So I'm gonna go back to the hotel room, charge it, get at least 20, 25% in, and that should get me at least up there try to catch the guys it's an out and back which is nice so i'll just as soon as it charges me in the next 30 minutes or so i'll see how far i can get before running into them <sighs> all right guys so got like about a 25 minute charge and it took me to 40 percent which should that's way more than enough to to do the ride so I'm gonna ride out, see how far I get before uh, they've turned around and catch me. So I am at least 40 minutes behind them because uh, by the time I got back and stuff, and uh, what a hassle. Um, opened up the E-Tube app and connected to the Bluetooth and then disconnected to, to make sure that like, for some reason it wasn't connected to the E-Tube app from my phone and that was draining the battery. Right now it says I have a charge of 40% onward. Here we go. Can I, can I, can I get yours? Can I get yours? Say, can I, can I, can I, can I, can I? Sitting at about 80, 85%, just trying to manage my effort. There's no way I'm going to catch them, but I'd like to see how far I can get 
before they've turned around and catch me. Wish I had fresh legs. Legs are a little sore from yesterday. I mean, they're okay. I am uh, about 21 miles in. This is a big climb. I don't have the legs right now. Hurting. Heart's fine, energy's fine. Legs hurt. Caught up to the team at the rest stop. Dude, going over that, that climb, I was holding good power and then after a while my legs just wouldn't do it. Heart rate was fine. Legs are like, screw you. <laughs> yeah, they, they've been here for about a half an hour, they said. So, I, I made pretty good time. They stopped to get coffee and have lunch. You're never gonna see this hat again, right? Mm -hmm. Alright, time to get going. Hopefully I don't die. <laughs> Two miles you got to carry that thing, man. That's 30, but it's for the love of my life. Dude, that's that's not arrow, so you're gonna take some arrow penalties. It will, but I figure you no, know, it's worth it for her. Yeah. And, and you're you're adding some grams. What is that like what? 50 grams? Dude. I figure my water is gonna go by down by at least 10 or 15. Dude, you're going up the climb, that's gonna that's gonna kick you, knock you down at least a minute. Steve said that this little bridge is to go over the creek, which is really a fault. The uh, Shulam, Little Shulam River. It's a, it's a fault. Is that what you said? Yeah, but it is. Yeah, just, okay. uh, it's the San Andreas Fault, it's where the North American and Pacific plates uh, converge. That was the climb on the way back. The other way is definitely longer. Yeah. Yeah. Plus we did. We, we've stopped yeah, for a flat. Because I, I think for that, I have 171. And that was insane for me. I say for a ride. Alley. Look at, look at that, look at that hat. Well, the ride's just about over. We're on the way back to the hotels. It'll be a good ride. Got to play with the team on the way back. It's kind of surprised I still had the legs for it. I smell good food. Back to the hotel, we had our coffee, a little snack before dinner. It's time to go. So I've got like 69 miles and 4,100 feet of climbing, 3,000 calories. So it's been a good day, good ride. I had, had fun. It was nice to, to, to make it to the rest stop uh, and catch the guys before they left. Uh, I just stayed on the pedals. Uh, Try not to go too hard because I knew I was going to have to ride back with them at some point. Kept a good steady tempo over that big climb. I, I really couldn't go that hard. My, my legs were hurting at, the, at that point. It was good. It was a good day. This was fun. This has been really great to come out here. Last day of camp. We'll get some coffee. The ride starts at 8 this morning. Definitely need some coffee. Getting ready to start the ride. Are we good? Everybody good? Last ride at camp. We're all here? Apparently like two hours. <laughs> The 
roads out here, like when you get into town, are just super bad. They're just potholes and lines and cracks and chips. Hey guys, so that that's it for the, the, the team camp video. The last day it just kind of rained and drizzled and I didn't want to take the camera out. We were also ripping each other's legs off at, at uh, various points in, in the ride. So we had some like really good efforts. Had a blast at team camp. It was fun to um, hang out with the guys and uh, just, you know, push and test our fitness. Paso Robles was a, a, a great place to go out and, and ride bikes. The first day of camp, I was just so tired I, I, from like the drive and just, you know, traveling the week before. And I did take my camera and it, it was probably the best day as far as like riding. It was just really, really cool. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed that. Like if you haven't, it helps the channel and subscribe if you haven't subscribed. Uh, more videos to come. Bye.